Hey everybody, welcome to another AI Plus video. Today we've been sitting back, uh, letting all the Flux stuff settle in. Everyone is having a lot of fun with it and we wanted to step back a little bit and let everything filter through. And we had only covering the, the, the important stuff to us when it regards to Flux. Um, so today we're covering this, MISO Control Net Flux Dev, and it's probably the first control net uh, to work well, really well with Flux. Um, we will link a, page, a link a, to this description, or to, to this page in the description, and it's really easy to install. We will also save this workflow that we made, and we will go ahead and put it on our Google Drive so you can download it. Um, they want you to make sure you update Comfy UI Suite for some errors that came up. So basically, this is a Mr. Lab line art uh, control net that works really well with Flux. If you haven't heard of Flux, then go, go on YouTube and search. There's about a million people talking about it right now. Um, right now, this control net is compatible with FP16 and FP8. And you can see by the examples that works out fairly well. You, all you have to do is you have to actually download the model right here, Mr. Line, Mr. Line Plux Dev One. Just download these, and you're going to put them in your models folder. If I could find them, I'm just going to show you real quick. Comfy Y models folder. It's the Misto line, right here, Misto model, and you just put them right there. So, there we go. This is the workflow for this. It's um, pretty compact. It has several nodes in it. Uh, we have the dual clip loader, obviously, clip L and T5 double XL. We have the checkpoint, which is going to be the Flux Dev FP8, what we're using the VAE standard, Flux VAE. Control Net is going to load Mr. Line Flux F1 along with the AnyLine line art processor. Laura, Laura, we're loading is going to be the Flux Realism, Laura. You have a clip, clip text and code, positive and negative. You wanna be as detailed as possible in these clip texts because it's very, very sensitive and it could ruin the image or you can get something you didn't want. You're gonna apply the MISTO control net flux right here to apply the control net and we have our load image. Uh, and then it goes into a case sampler for MISTO CN flux. So you do have to make sure you, uh, you know, get clone that um, node so that you get all these nodes. We up the steps to 20. Everything else should be about the same guidance as for the seed is randomized. So we are going to do, we actually did one here. It's an office. And the prompt is dark office room, muted colors, cozy, mysterious night shot. So we expected this to be dark. So here is the image and here is the misto line. It does really well getting all uh, the lines and everything it needs. And here is the final. Again, we expected it to be really dark because that's how we prompted it for. But if we change that to day, we'll just put colorful office daytime. Um, we'll put um, sharp focus full frame camera grain what is a grain rain okay okay we're gonna take this put that there and then we're going to prompt to that just to see what it does with this office shot uh, just to change it up a little bit the negative is what we kept it's in their workflow so we just kept that the way it is this strength is what you want to play with. It starts out at 0.50. If you go too low, it starts to really wreck the image. If you go too high, it turns it into monsters. So keep it 0 0.50, 0 0.60, and 
and see what it does. You can experiment with that. Guidance as well. 3.5 is the guidance. It suggests we went down as low as 2 and it was still okay. But I don't suggest going any higher because then it will really distort the image to where you would want to throw your computer out the window and call your mom. So the steps is a 20 and we are going to see what it gives us with that new prompt. Okay, this is what it gave us with that new prompt. Nice, colorful office. Very cheerful. Lights are nice. I, you can probably prompt to have something on the wall. Text even, because it's flux. Um, but that is the image it came up with. Fairly cool. 960 by 960. You can upscale this as you want. You'll probably add one on the end of the workflow. So let's just see what other images we can do. Um... Let's see here, we can get, where did we, uh, let's see, okay, let's do one of Danny, let's do this one, and the image, let's do, let's go to Civit AI. Let's go to Civit AI and just grab a prompt because that's what we like to do. Uh, this one's cool. There you go. We're just going to grab that. Thank you for the RC Brain Zoe for, let, for providing that prompt. We're just going to paste and copy and paste it here. Okay, you're gonna keep prompt. So it's gonna go off of that prompt and see what it comes up with. There is a lot of lines in there, especially got the zero in the cup. Got Danny pretty well. And uh, we'll see what that comes up with. Okay, that prompt probably threw it for a loop, but that's what it came up with um, based on the prompt. Maybe I should not have used the prompt, but really accurate to detail you can tell where it was it did not get the cup but it did try its best to create that so we're gonna do another one let's do um one of blanca we can find her let's do uh, blanca which one which one do you want us to do and i think she would say probably this one because she's lounging in a chair. And we're going to make this a little bit more easy. We'll do, um, hang man. Well, at a park. Sun shining. Is that? Shining. Um, birds all around. I don't know why I just said that, but I'm going to do it. And then we will go ahead and do that. I didn't provide any more details other than that. We will see what it comes up with there. Mr. Line picked it up. Fairly nice. And we'll see what it comes up with. Okay, this is what it came up with. I did lower the, the guidance to two to give it a little bit more creative freedom. And that's what it came up with a nice cartoonish drawn image I didn't want that but flux does sometimes like to do whatever it wants uh, so that's pretty cool I like that Blanca will like it as well so you can play around with this stuff to bit in the guidance two three five whatever you want to do um, that'll drastically change the image the strength and also the guidance here play around with it see what you come up with um, also you can swap in different Laura's if you want to do that uh, there's a hyper Laura in there you can put in there so check that out make sure you like and subscribe to our videos I have fuzz we're not dead we're still here and we'll be posting more videos as we see fit so catch you guys next time have a good night bye